Hi guys, how you all doing? My name is Jemtobe Amir. All things African Nana. In the largest, <laughs> the largest market in Africa, Gikomba Open Air Market. So I'm going to do a haul later on because I'm vlogging with my phone and I'm scared. Don't move. in Gikomba. Papi, I'm going to go. Our Dolin Yafa, i Guys, we are inside the Gikomba Kabisa. We are going to the shoes. You see, 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 to go kundani dani. So I've shopped some things. Nita wape. None of them are going to be here. Nita wape. Haul. Already here is a bag. I'm still going shopping and then we'll do a haul. This is one of the things I love about African content. Yeah. This is I love about African content. Shopping in the thrift market. This is the difference. <laughs> yeah, so. See how when you're trying to talk and you the way. Guys, give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't. So, bye. So today I'm gonna to be showing you my camera is almost died. What a haul! I promised you I, I did a haul. I've been trying to show my sister some other things I bought. So this whole bag is yes, recycle. This whole bag is the haul, and mostly is um, homeware. Is it homeware kitchen now? So the first one that I'm so excited about. I, I was showing my sister. So it's this bag. Is it called a vest? A vest? A planter? This a planter. So I bought this at. It's ceramic. Yes. I bought this at 800 Kenyan shillings. And it's basically a planter. I can decide to put my plants here. Snake plant. Yes, I know I need to show for plants because my room is looking bare. And my my paint my art work i used a double mask whatever and didn't work so i need to like put uh, nails install my art frame with nails so i'll do that so this i need up i think i'm gonna put plants on it or maybe i'll put spoons i don't know so i bought also two spoons and one spoon is 150 kenyan shillings. so for the three spoons is for the two spoons is 300 kenyan shillings and if you want usd conversion you can just divide by 100 to get approximate in usd kenyan shillings and two spoons i don't know like maybe I'll, i put here my spoons and my muikos or i put my snake plant comment down below what should i put this vase nini nini plant my snake plant or or spoons but yeah and guys please let me know what this spoon is for 
because i don't know why this one has all holes and this one doesn't have holes comment down also that below guys and then the next thing i bought is these two things you guys know i love baking so i bought uh, this one is so heavy so this is a i think it's a cake pan the reason why you remove like this i don't know also but i guess because you have to remove the cake so that it doesn't like split i don't know so it's like this and yeah it's like this and then you remove i think when you, you bake your cake it removes like this but it's a cake and it's actually quite new okay you don't want to when you put your butter oh no will it not like spill hmm? Okay. I don't know, but well, because I'm the home, sometimes I'll feel like taking cake, so I'll bake a small cake like that. Another thing is, I bought this also. The reason why I bought this is because it says it's suitable for for use in oven, also suitable for microwave and also feels suitable on the freezer and it's made in japan and you all know guys japan is legit when they make products it's really nice and it's two and a half pint softly what is softly by the way i don't know so i don't know what i'll cook on this can i cook my chicken in this can i cook my casseroles when they say casseroles i can cook on this thing and I just bought it because it's nice these flowers are really bothering me but it's it is okay it's also ceramic so i like this and it's from edge rose this one i bought oh this one i bought at 300 kenyan shillings this one i bought at how much did the guy told me it's 500 i think it's 500 500 kenyan shillings and then like in the in this guy one guy's shop i bought everything at Two thousand because I gave him three thousand and he returned one hundred. So another thing is this one, and now looking at it, it has some dust. But I feel like when I'm thrifting, I kind of like this how uh, this marks like it shows me that it has been used and it's strong. So this bowl, like here, yes, this. But this is why it's called thrifting. You can see the marks. But I feel like I just need a clear bowl because I'll be doing cooking videos and I want it to be seen when I'm mixing things on the thing. I want another like three bowls like this and I'll be done. Three or one. Yes, I want a bigger one than this and then I'll be done. So another thing I bought at the guy, this guy's store, is these uh, mittens. Are they called mittens? Yes, and it's from color sky was and i bought it at 150 so at least now at the oven i have some things 150 kenya shillings another thing i bought i'm doing the kitchen house too, finally further the spoons i bought measuring spoons here they are finally so it's a one teaspoon it's one teaspoon this is one tablespoon and 15 millimeters one tablespoon 15 millimeters a quarter a quarter teaspoon and half half a teaspoon so i have all my measuring things and this one i bought at 150 kenya shillings now at least i have really good measurements because i usually measure with my eyes and when you're baking you need to when you're doing anything you need to know really well what you're doing so the next thing i bought is spoons i bought four four forks and they were at 30 30 shillings i think this is a fish fork am i right am i right because look at how it is like there I don't know and then this other spoon for forks and then i have this spoon like that and then the sugar spoon is the 
I think it's a sugar spoon. I may be wrong. Teaspoon. Yeah. One, two, three, four. So I bought the spoons at 30 Kenya shillings. Uh, what else did I buy? That's all. Ah, no, 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 no. That's not all. I bought this thingy. This, uh, these are called table mats. Hopefully, the reason I bought this, this one's I bought at 200 each. So it's 400. This Jama, But the price you see, it was, the initial price was $7. And this means it's just like new. So I like, by the way, guys, Gikomba is like a thrift market. So yeah. I, I hope you understand so yes so this is what i love this color by the way so i'll be placing because i don't have a table yet okay i hope this one will not burn because there's another fake table mat i put it burnt through so i hope this one i'll test it i'll test this one first this one already has a mark but it's okay it's a color so this one's um, 400 for the two of them and yeah i like it i like they look like so and i'll be cooking i don't want to nini my my working space my nini i'll be putting my food there <sighs> and then another thing i bought is of course this uh this slippers when i'm going it's from Koi 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 Koi. what's this name so these slippers they are basically like brand new and these are like beach slippers or when i'm going at the rooftop or just going outside to pick up my deliveries just walking around shoes especially the swimming because they are like i don't know like plastic so yeah and i have a flat feet i wanted crocs so bad but i don't know why crocs hurt my my flat feet like here Crocs hurt me here, so that's that. And I'm happy with my purchases. Then the next thing I bought, guys, is shorts. Lots and lots of shorts. This other one. It's lots and lots of shorts. And then I bought at the market. Pie, isn't it? I bought this lemon lemon lime. Someone told me this is alcohol lime. But I don't know, just say lemon here. So a lot of lemon, like this, I think it's so much lemons because I want to be drinking first thing I drink in the morning, lemon water in the next summer. When I sleep, lemon water, it really helps a lot. And the last thing is clothes, guys. I bought a lot of clothes. I bought a lot of clothes shorts, which I think I should do a haul for you guys. I think I'll do the haul later, like a different kind of haul when I've washed them and they are clean. But for now, I'm just going to be showing you and then I will, when I clean them, no, I will wear for you. So this one, one, this another one, two, you can see, and then another one, like women with clothes. So this has like house and beach. And this linen, you can see, linen short. I think I'll just do a different haul for you guys for this. So now, I'm gonna let me just show you and then it will catch in the corner. This is another one, this pink nude. This is another one. Guys, let me just do a haul for you. It will be a separate video because I feel it's already long. It's another one. This one. This one. Okay, guys, that's it for today. I know I totally told you I'm gonna wear, uh, try on all the things I bought, but I forgot, guys. I forgot. So I've washed it. This is like weeks again. This is my first biker bike shot. Ooh, nice. Please excuse my blanket, my duvet is being washed. So that's one. So 
let me know <laughs> exactly let me know on the comment section down below if you would love for me to try on all the shorts that i bought at gomba and that's it for today guys don't forget to like comment and subscribe and i wish you i know my subscribers i have from kenya I have from united states I have from uk germany and europe and america you're about to i think you're on spring going on to summer i don't know how you love guys you guys love summer so don't forget let me know if you want <laughs> i'm wishing you a good weather okay so let me know and to see what kenya we are approaching rainy seasons so so anyway please let me know if you want a try on haul for the shorts down below this is my first biker shot i don't know if i will be comfortable enough to go with this outside <laughs> but at least i live okay of course i need like a more baggy nanny but i look cute for houseware and maybe go take my shopping my delivery things like that you know yeah guys so mwah. thank you so much for watching my channel and we are all on 30k subscribers thank you so being with me through the canteen and always thank you until next time bye bye